I see you're recording because I could tell by your Okay. Hi, welcome to Lessons with John. Uh, today is 2 5 day, and uh, last time we did the C minor 9 uh, like this, but today we're going to do it a little bit differently. Fifth string, uh, third fret. I'm going to reach back fourth string, first fret, and then this time I'm going to bar my third finger on the top three strings. So three, two, and one, like that. And then when I go to my F, which is my five chord. I can do it like that. It is painful. Okay, so that's the sixth string first fret, the fourth string first fret, and then I'm going to bar the second fret, the top three strings like that. A lot of people will do it like this with the thumb. So you go. because it's down at the end where the nut is and there's a lot of tension there. So if we moved it up, say say I want to play in the key of uh, E flat. So I got an F minor 9. And then like that. So I just thought of something. You could play it like this. F minor 9. And then you could put your pinky down or you could go like this. That's an even better way to do it. So, uh, what do I start with? F minor 9. So I'm barring it. And then when I do my B flat major 7, no, no, I'm sorry, my B flat 13, I'm going to play 6th string, 6th fret, 4th string, 6th fret, 3rd uh, string, 7th fret, and I'm going to take my pinky. And it's not that difficult. I'm going to bar the 8th fret top two strings. Okay? Looks painful. It's really not. And then, I can bar with my 3rd to get that passing. And then, an E flat major 9 or an E flat major 7 would do. Um, either one will do. So if we go back to where we started, and then with the pinky, and then I flat it. down below. Uh, please subscribe and play more guitar.